Luckily, we just passed the sign for the state prison. It said, do not pick up hitchhikers. So we're, we're really well poised right now for a roadside breakdown. I think I heard there's a new Uber expansion plan for the middle of the desert. You got Ubers. You got Ubers out here in five minutes. Uber XL. They're all Indian. Tell you what, I've never wanted. See, I've never wanted more in my life to see an Indian face driving a driving a Corolla that smells like cereal, like fruity pebbles. Never in my life have I wanted it more. You know, the other day I was in the Whole Foods parking lot. And there was a guy, black guy. He's got a clipboard beard, super long basketball shorts. He looks like DJ Chaos, but he had a clipboard. So he's obviously trying to get money for something. Plan signatures for Planned Parenthood, something like that. I said, Go on. Should I start over from the thing? I just yeah, said? yeah, yeah. Because you know when a guy when a guy that looks like DJ Chaos is coming at you with a clipboard, you're in for a long conversation. He's got... He's got a, an end to his means, and he's, he aims to extract from you whatever value he can get, whether it be a signature, tell you, you know, sell you a mixtape, what have you. I already said the line that I said. I said, boy, oh boy. I already said that? Yeah. I'll say it again. I said to myself, boy, oh boy, just what I wanted to see, a black guy with a clipboard. I know the next 45 minutes of my life are going to be filled with fun, factual information. But thankfully, he said, Sir, excuse me, you an Arizona resident? I said, no. He said, thank you, sir, have a good day. Didn't apply to me. Good to go, I guess. Anyway, we're in the desert. We're about to get raped. Bye. Now, we got the fan on, and that is some stinky air. Because the other day when we did our off-roading... We forgot that there were a bunch of glass bottles and also food in the back. So now underneath all the folding seats, inside the tire, spare tire area, basically every crevice that's accessible, uh, there's now rotting food and glass. And this truck smells stink. It smells stink. If I, was, if I were Jar Jar Binks in Star Wars Episode 2... I would say, Misa smell stinkum. That's it? There's also us in here. There's two, there's two 250 pound human air fresheners sitting up front. And I'm sweating right now. This is sauna grade stuff. We got six minutes left. Oh, let's go baby. Six miles. If, if we make it, I will never disrespect GM again if this reserve tank makes it. Now, it's because the language is set to, to uh, Spanish here. No, he contiendo multimedia para explorar aquí. And it says autonomia baja, which means remaining mileage empty or something. Autonomia. Autonomia. I mean, it's a Mountain Dew flavor. It's Mountain Dew flavor baja. Um, and I thought that meant I was in baja mode. But it actually meant the gas tank's empty. So while I was thromping on the gas pedal, trying to squeeze out everything Baja mode had to give, I was actually burning our last bit of fuel. So, and our and possibly our comfort. And I, oh yeah, our comfort for the rest of the well, our comfort for the rest of the day is done because we're now wet. We're now nice and wet. Going right to the venue. Right to the venue, and I'm soggy in my bottom. I might as well have pissed my pants. It would probably be more comfortable. It would be warmer. I get my electrolytes reabsorbed. Right now, I'm just sitting in, in wet. Ugh. Also, this is gross. This is yucky stuff right here. Watermelon water. Where is this made? China. Bottle of the source. Watermelon Springs. There's a, there's a natural spring that just shoots watermelon out. It's in New York City. Made by Caribe Juice, Charlottesville, VA. Okay. Delicious hydration. Well. Five minutes. Do or die time, Chris. It's like they're here. With, it's like they're along for the ride. You guys, it's like you're along for the ride. This is exciting. 
Now, this, this is a problem that could definitely be solved if I were able to run 60 miles an hour for multiple hours. You ever think that? I wish sometimes. If I could run 60 miles an hour for several hours at a time, we'd have this whole problem hitched up. But I can't. I can't climb a set of stairs without sweating and wheezing. Tune back into the Desert Channel after the commercial break. We'll be dead. Thank you. We remain undefeated. Nature and my incompetence could not stand in our way today. We're aided, of course, by General Motors Corporation. They make a great Halo 3 Warthog glass carrier. And, uh, of course, Valero. We got a shout out our sponsor, Valero. Best male bathrooms in the state. Who else, Chris? What else we got? Uh, the, uh, the town of Blythe. The town of Blythe, the OU. State police. Uh, truckers have passed this going 80. Yep. Uh, yeah, man. Just thankful to be alive right now. Thank you, God. God bless America. Los Angeles, we will see you shortly. We'll be there right on time. Sun-kissed. A little bit of heat on my cheese. It's 110 outside. Been riding with no AC. A little bit of cheese. Mm. It's like a grilled cheese sandwich. The good part. I'm stuck behind a diesel truck, so the whole thing, whole car smells like diesel. I got some nice glistening cheese here. I'm going in for the Swiss, guys. Mmm. Mmm. Perf. Welcome. Smells like a sock. If you do a commercial photography, you gotta make the cheese look appetizing, okay? You gotta let the cheese glisten in the sun a little bit. Get the oils out. Now, if you need chapstick, My lips are now hydrated perfectly with the power of cheese. Hey. Hey, death officer. Death officer. <laughs> How are you? Mm -hmm. mm. That's the good stuff right there. You couldn't pay me not to eat this cheese. It melts right off the bone. It's so tender, it comes right off the bone. <laughs>